NASA plans to launch rockets from northern Australia for scientific research within weeks. It's the first time NASA has launched rockets from a commercial facility outside the US. That private spaceport is the Arnhem Space Center, which is owned and operated by a company called Equatorial Launch Australia. About 75 NASA personnel will be in Australia for the event. During a media briefing in the city of Darwin on Wednesday, Prime Minister Anthony Albanese said he hoped the project would inspire young people. This is a really exciting uh, project. Uh, this is about not just uh, the uh, rocket launches itself, but it's about sending a message uh, to younger Australians and indeed Australians of any age who might be looking at, at retraining uh, for future careers of how important science is. Uh, we want uh, the next generation uh, to really look at STEM as part of Australia's future and uh, that's why uh, this is an important project. The NASA missions will investigate heliophysics, astrophysics and planetary science phenomena that can only be seen from the Southern Hemisphere. The launches will be the first by the US Space Agency from Australia since 1995.